Yeah, something like two weeks ago, I had a meeting with one of the departments in my company, and I was having conversation with these guys. And uh, there is a part of me that always liked to tell people what I think they should understand, even though it's against what I should tell them. For example, I love to tell my employees something like, I don't care about you working for me. If tomorrow you want to go and build a company, I would like that because it means you give job to somebody else, you know. Naturally, entrepreneurs shouldn't talk to their employees to go and build business because, you know, you want to lose an asset. Okay, now let me go back to the story I'm, I'm sharing, which is, you know, I was telling these guys about the reason why most people don't succeed in life is they don't want to die. And I was challenging them that they shouldn't care about not dying. They shouldn't care about dying uh, because... You know, life is like give and take. If you do not want to lose your life, then you will lose it. It's just as simple as that. So let me go to my personal story. You see, when I announced to people that I wanted to build a company, what everybody told me was, you cannot do that in Africa. Nobody's going to help you. And there was a warning that actually came to me after five years of failure in the business world. And uh, somebody in my family called me and told me, now I'm warning you, if you go ahead and destroy your life, don't come back to me. And I look at myself, I look at the skies and told myself, if I destroy my life, I will still be proud of myself. Because this is what I want to achieve. So if I destroy my life trying to achieve what I want to achieve, I will still be proud of myself in the grave. And that is the mindset of almost everybody who achieves success. If you want it bad enough, you will have it. But listen, that also means if you want it bad enough, you can lose your life looking for it. But for me, it's, it's not a big deal. So this is what I challenge people to do. Sit down and ask yourself, what exactly do I want to do with my life? What exactly do I want to achieve that if I achieve it, I will be proud of myself forever and ever? Now, if you can figure that out, then you are good to die. If that is a good English. What I mean is, if you figure out what you can live for, what you will be proud of forever, then you are now having a certificate that permits you to die. So let me try and simplify that and show you what it means. Now, let's say your biggest dream in life is to climb Mount Everest and get to the top of Mount Everest. Now you have what you can die for. It essentially means if tomorrow... You are practicing to climb Mount Everest and you die. You are a successful individual. Or let's say you are trying to climb Mount Everest and you die in the process. You are a successful individual. Why? Well, because you die trying to achieve what is the most important thing to your life. Now, let's go to entrepreneurship. Let's say your biggest dream in life is to have financial freedom. Maybe you don't know, this is a big dream. 99.9% .9 of human beings will not get to a point in their life when they don't worry about money again. Now, that is your dream. You want to get to a point uh, where you don't worry again about money and you figure out, okay, it means I will build a company. Now, you want to build a company. What if you make mistake trying to build a company? What if everybody in the world rejects you and worst? What if you die trying to do it? I tell you, you are a successful individual. Why? Where? You die trying to be who you were born to be. Okay, what is the point of life? If I may ask, you want to live to 80 years and so what? You want to live to 135 years? What does that do to anybody? I will respect a man who died at 22 trying to achieve what he believes is the most important thing to him than a man who lived to 89. But he knows within himself that he has lived all his life in fear of what will happen, in fear of failure, in fear of what other people will say. Oh, this is a rant, and I'm not even sure it makes any sense to anybody. But this is my channel anyway, so I have certificate to do that. Now this is what I'm telling you. Debt is not the biggest thing or the most painful thing that can happen to a human being. To me, the worst thing that can happen to a human being is to get to your deathbed and remember that you have lived all your life in fear. In fear of 
failure, in fear of mistakes, in fear of what other people would say, in fear of death. What is your dream? Figure it out and fight hard. Fight. Fight. That is the word. With the last drop of the blood in your vein, fight. Then you might want to ask me, what if I don't achieve my dream even though I fight? Again, you are a successful person by the mere fact that you fight. I hope this video helps you. If it does, yeah, maybe you share with somebody. Uh, if it doesn't help you, I'm sorry for wasting your time. You can check the description of this video uh, to join my business university. I try to teach people what I know about entrepreneurship. And most importantly, I try to inspire people to fight. That is what it is. Fight for your dream. You have a single life.